Hey, what are you doing? I just finished the front and the uh, wind's picking up a little bit, so I thought I'd make a few adjustments. You want to make a real adjustment? Try these. They've won me three majors. Wilson Staff? <laughs> Seriously? Podrick Harrington? Seriously. Hello. My name is Mark Gauger, and I'm the PGA head golf professional out here at Timber Creek and Sierra Pines Golf Courses. In this month's conversation, I'd like to talk about being quiet during your golf swing. As you know, the secret to golf is being aware of your target while you're swinging. And the way to unlock that secret is by making solid ball contact. I believe that solid contact can be more consistently achieved if we reduce the amount of unnecessary movements. And I've found that in my experience that any movement that is made in the backswing is going to need to be made in the forward swing. For instance, if my body moves back, then it will need to have to move forward, and the odds of getting back to where we started begin to reduce drastically. We could say that this is also the case with other movements as well, the spine angle, the hands, etc., etc. If you watch tour players swing the golf club, one thing you might notice is that their head remains very still. Oftentimes we find that when the head moves, the body is going to follow. By reducing movement, we will turn around our center, allowing for the club to return to the point of contact much more consistently. So the next time you go out to play or practice, make one of your intentions or commitments to be quiet in your golf swing, and I think you'll find that you'll become a much better ball striker. Well, we're back here in the Timber Creek Golf Shop, and check out the coupon at the bottom of the page. This month, if you buy two dozen tailor-made Tour Preferred Premium Golf Balls, we're going to give you a fitted tailor-made hat with Timber Creek on the front along with it. Thanks so much. We'll see you next month.